Metals. They are strong, hard to fuse, and not fragile. No, metals are very fragile, light, and very fusible substances. Why fragile? Because they are, that's it. Just look. Here is a steel spoon. And now, with some effort, I can... Now you'll see how strong TV presenter can be. Well, that's difficult. But I've bent a thin steel spoon. Okay, the spoon. You hear the sound? A piece of cake. And? One, two, three, four. And it's broken. So today we're going to talk about fragile metals. Yes, today is about fragile metals. The spoon which Dennis broke so easily is made of gallium. This metal is not much stronger than glass. Gallium is not only fragile, but also easy to fuse. It turns the liquid at temperatures even less than 30 degrees Celsius. That means that gallium can literally melt in your hand or by putting it in hot water for a short time. Molten gallium is quite similar to mercury, both in appearance and properties. But unlike mercury, gallium is non-toxic. Once, it was even used for dental fillings. These very unusual qualities of gallium are related to the unique structure of its crystal lattice. Other metals consist of separate atoms, but gallium has diatomic molecules, which means their bond is very weak. That is why gallium turns from a solid to a liquid so quickly. Of course, gallium is wonderfully suitable for jokes. Anton, give me some sugar, please. Sugar, of course. One? No, just a little bit. What? You have to be careful with the things you use to stir your drinks. Here, take a normal spoon. Thank you. What happened? Now it's important. You shouldn't drink this. Take some lemon. Come on.